Is there something wrong with your leopard gecko's eyes? Does it look cloudy? Or is he squinting a lot? Is he not able to find his food? Is he losing weight? Are you worried that he might be going blind? By the light. Sounds like you need a reptile vet. Hi, I'm Dr. Balderrama, and welcome to Happy Healthy Herps, where you get free veterinary advice for your pet reptiles and amphibians. So click on the little frog to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any great content. So is your leopard gecko going blind? Well, maybe, or maybe not. It's impossible to say about a thorough veterinary exam, but eye problems in geckos are very common. I can't see. So if your leopard gecko is experiencing any eye cloudiness, discharge, squinting, redness or inflammation, or any type of sunken eyed appearance, then you should take them to a vet. Bottom line is, if you wouldn't want your own eye looking like that, Ew. you should see a vet. There are a lot of reasons why geckos can have eye problems. Bacterial infections, viral infections, cancer, trauma, or even substrate problems like sand in the eye. But the most common eye problem has to do with humidity. Often when the temperatures are too low and there's not enough humidity, Geckos can have trouble shedding the lining underneath their eyelid, so a bunch of cellular debris starts accumulating there, kind of like leaves in a rain gutter. This can cause a loss of vision, and over time can lead to something more serious, like permanent blindness. Now if this happens to your gecko, your veterinarian can flush out the eye and gently remove all that debris. Your veterinarian may also send home some antibiotics in case there's any infection. Your vet may also need to stain the eye to see if there's any trauma. Kind of like when your cute little puppy gets too close to the cat. Now you may have heard that snakes can have a retained eye spectacle from a bad shed and you have to manually remove it. Don't do that. Unlike snakes, leopard geckos don't have spectacles. Unlike other geckos, leopard geckos have true eyelids. So unlike snakes, they can't get a retained eye spectacle. In fact, the scientific name for a leopard gecko, Eublepharis, means true eyelid. How's that for a fun fact of the day? So nobody cares. So one way to help out your leopard gecko's eyes is to increase the humidity. Now I know what you're thinking. You're saying, hey, Dr. Balderrama, don't leopard geckos come from a dry desert area? Why do they need humidity? Well, they do live in the desert, but in the wild, they also have access to a burrow where it's nice and humid. More steam. More steam! So the bottom line is, give them more humidity. Their eyes will thank you for it. I think my eyes are getting better. You can do this by making a humidity hide. First, get a Tupperware sandwich container and cut a hole in the middle of it. And then get some sphagnum moss or some coconut fiber. Make sure you keep it nice and moist and change out the substrate every few weeks. Or better yet, give them two humidity hides, each in a separate corner of the tank. That should really help with your gecko's eye problems. And don't forget to talk to your vet about vitamin A. Vitamin A deficiencies have been linked to eye problems in geckos. So talk to your vet about which vitamin A products they recommend. Thanks for watching. And remember, if your gecko has an eye problem, see your vet right away. If you don't have a reptile vet, check out the website of the Association of Reptile and Amphibian Veterinarians. On there is a link where you can find a reptile vet near you. Don't forget to like this video and make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell. And I'll see you in the next video.